What is going on guys, it is your boy Alec Miller 31 here, and I am back with episode 6 of my NHL GM mode here on the Xbox 360 on NHL 14. That was a messed up intro. But today we are taking on the Phoenix Coyotes, and you see the standings on your screen right now. We're actually not doing so bad, but I've played a couple games after this one, and we are doing pretty bad. So, yeah, but here is the injury screen right now. It, we have some pretty nasty injuries so yeah we got a lot of key players that are out for a couple weeks more than a couple weeks but we will get a uh, we will get brian campbell back in three weeks which is a huge defensive gain for us so yeah we're at home today and i want to get into the reason why i haven't been posting i i haven't really been in the mood to edit anything or just record anything which is sort of weird because I always want to record and I always want to do YouTube stuff. But that hasn't really been happening for me. I mean, I've wanted to record and stuff, but it just hasn't been working for me. But here we get a fast break with Peter Miller, and he will put this one into the back of the net. Five minutes into the first period, and we are already looking good. But coming into this game, Florida has been doing really good. And I have sh I showed you the last game versus Tampa, and I think we got a win there, but I'm not sure. But, yeah, there's that, and we are actually coming up on the um, All-Star break. I think I might do one video before the All-Star break, or actually just just do um, another video before the All-Star break. So, and that will end the first period there. We we take, we take go to the first intermission with a 2 no or a one nothing lead, my bad. one nothing lead, so, yeah, um, you see some good saves by Markstrom. And he's, he's been disappointing for me this year. But in some games, he's really good. But in some games, he's really bad. So it's like, it's, it's sort of like my goalies, like Jose Th Jose Theodore and Markstrom. I mean, they've been doing really good and really bad. But in the offseason, I have been looking to um get a new goalie. Like, maybe like a um, Devin Dubnik, say free agent and stuff like that. But I will... Maybe I, I can uh, do an update video for you guys on, like, the free agents in my team roster and stuff like that. So, leave that in the comments if you want me to do that. But, yeah, we're starting the second period here. Uh, they actually get off to a good start, but now we have the puck, and we are going this for Stieg, and he will pull that one back and get a good shot on goal, and that will give us the 2-0 lead over Phoenix. So, Phoenix hasn't been looking very good in this game. I mean... We've, they've had some good shots, but we've had some good shots, and our shots have just gone to the back of the net. So, yeah, I mean, um, I think they come on the power play here soon. But you know what's weird in this game? They have Yamer Yager, but look at this goalie mistake. What is Markstrom doing? I mean, Markstrom in this game made some massive mistakes, like that one right there. He was just like... 10 feet or something out of his goal crease and then he just turns around and doesn't even want to face a shot but yeah in this game phoenix actually has yager which is weird to me because who's he play for in real life i just looked this up last night oh yeah he plays for new jersey and he used to play for someone else i don't know but uh, phoenix has yager and yager actually gets kicked out of this game which I find really funny. But we're in the third now. And then Yager. Oh my gosh. Yager. Gosh darn it. Stop making. Stop letting Yager shoot the puck. Because right now he has two goals. And he could have one more. Which he's making me mad. But they are actually on the 5 on 3 power play. Which look at this right here. Markstrom has thought he had the puck. And then boom. He lets it right into the back of the net. Really? Really Markstrom? Like what? Like, I'm so mad about this game that I should have won it. But then Markstrom lets up three goals, and we're down. But we come up with 22 seconds left in the game. In the game, and they dump it in, but they still have the puck in our own zone. And Markstrom makes a good save there. One of his many, or <coughs> one of his few in the game. But here's Jonathan Heberdeau. What a shot, Jonathan Heberdeau. Getting us the tie game with 4.4 seconds left. <coughs> Excuse me. Getting the lead, his 21st of the season, Jonathan Huberto. What a shot. He just pulls it back and lets it, boom, right off the crossbar. Man, what a goal, Jonathan Huberto. So that ties us the game. And I'll spoil it right now with 4 seconds left in the game. We do end up going into overtime. So, yeah, I mean... 
Not to. <coughs> oh, one minute. Oh, all right. So yeah, nothing really happened in no T. No one had shots or anything. But I was on the uh, I was on the power play because Yamer Yager got a game misconduct. So yeah, so we're getting into the shootout here. My first shootout recorded of this um, GM mode. So very interesting to see what Markstrom can do and my big people like Fleischman, Hebert, and Versti to see what they can do in the shootout. But Phoenix will have the first shot, and what will Markstrom do? He will save this one right in the crease. I mean, he just had the backup, really, to his goal. But he, he, here is Hiberto. I, I don't know what I was doing. I think I was texting during this moment. So it's just a minute of me just sitting here. And then we start moving with Hiberto. We cut to the outside, and then we pull it back, and we get a good shot off with Hiberto. So we take the one nothing shootout lead. Now, all right. So they have the second shot here, and they just fooled Markstrom out. Sorry if my audio is a bit cut up because in my eye maybe froze for a bit. But here we go with Huberto now, and that will be saved by the goalie of Phoenix. So. Like, I don't get how our first shooter was got the goal really good, but then our, like, our shots were, like, basically the same, but they didn't go into the back of that. But I guess I should have done stuff different because I sort of do the same thing over and over again on, um, on shootouts, but here they go, and what will they do? And they put the puck in the back of the net. Stupid Markstrom. I bet if maybe I had Theodore in the net, maybe... They would um, do something different, but that was our last shooter of the game, and we do end up losing this game. So not not a good one from the, uh, well, it was a good way to start out the game, but not a good way to finish the game by the Florida Panthers. Um, bad mistakes, bad goalie, bad goalie stuff. I mean, Markstrom, I gave him a chance, but Theodore will go to be our starter. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like. Comment and subscribe down below. This has been your boy Alec Miller31. See you next time. Peace.